Fred, welcome home. Congratulations on the championship. The people are filling up downtown once again here to see you. They can't wait to see you. They can't wait to hear from you. How much are you looking forward to today and sharing this great achievement with all the Rockford people? Yeah, really looking forward to it. You know, it's, uh, it's exciting, you know, not only for me, but for our city and for the people here. And, uh, you know, we're kind of all experiencing this together for the first time. So uh, it's pretty cool. And um, just to be able to, to come back and share, share that experience has been dope. We had two watch parties here during the NBA Finals. The first one drew about 3,000 folks. The second one, 6,000 folks. How aware were you at the time of what was happening back here in Rockford? Yeah, I was I was in tune a little bit. Obviously, you know, my team is kind of the people who put it together. So we had the first one or two at the district, and I was aware of that. And then they told me they were thinking about moving it outside. So I was starting to look forward to that. And and uh, just to be able to see the outpour of people who came out, is, uh, it was kind of breathtaking, you know, to be not here, but to see the videos and the pictures, it, it, looked, it looked crazy. So it's super cool, man, for our city and something that I haven't seen in, in, in my time here. So we're, we're all kind of creating history together. Everybody loves a winner, but there's something about you that just draws people in. What is it do you think that makes people of Rockford identify so strongly with Fred Van Vliet? I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm here. I'm, I'm from here. Um, it's a good story, obviously, but um, I'm a Rockford kid, and, and most people can relate to that. And uh, we all share some type of similar qualities of what we had to go through and, and living in the city and, and what that entails and what comes with that. So people identify with that for the most part. And I think people are receptive of the fact that I, I proudly carry the flag. You know what I mean? I don't run from it. I don't hide from it. And I, I, I carry it loudly. And I let people know where I'm from and, and just trying to, you know, put our city on the map um, and, and kind of represent. Is there one moment from the clinching game, one play, one moment that night that you keep replaying in your mind that's going to be burned in your memory forever? Uh, just the shot, you know, the last shot, the last three I made, the step back. Uh, that, was, that was a big time shot for us. and. Uh, you know, just being able to go out there and make plays for our, for my team and, and for my teammates to, to win a championship like that is is, uh, is special. So you know, I, I got all of those plays on, on instant replay in my head on loop. So I'll be living living in that for a little bit, obviously, until I start back working out, getting ready for next year. I'm sure you dreamed about that as a kid, right? Uh, coming up big in a championship clincher. Always. That's all you think about. Um, even even now, to the, even just as, as early as this year, last year, when you're working out, you have to visualize something. You think about making games winners or you think about having big games and and in big games and um, you know it's, it's just special to be able to see it all come to fruition your dental work looks good that's all taken care of right yeah I got, I got that fixed as soon as I got back the next day so I'm um, dealing with a little bit of a uh, pain and stuff like that but you know uh, I got my tooth back at least yeah. saw Fred jr. a minute ago Fred jr.'s doing good huh? yeah he's around he's around it's keeping me up late nights uh, <laughs> doing this job but it, it's been fun to to be able to have that, you know, sprinkled in the mix of winning a championship to um, have my son born is, is uh, it's a blessing. Any chance we're going to see you in Space Jam? Uh, no, <laughs> not, not not Space Jam too. Maybe maybe I get on the next one if there's start a, your own movie. If there's a three, yeah, yeah. So you know me, uh, we'll figure something else out to counteract that.